Now in today's video, I'm going to be sharing with you guys the right software, the right softwares to use. And in this category, I cover the best softwares for graphics design on mobile devices, both for personal and commercial purposes. Now, if you haven't watched my video on the copyright rules governing graphics design, be sure to check it out before watching this video. Link will be in the video's description below. Now, if you have, let's get down to it. Now, a beautiful and professional design can also be achieved on mobile devices these days. And if your creative skills is very good, nobody can tell the difference from a graphics design on computers to that which you did on mobile. It all comes down to your creative imagination skills and the right softwares for the job. Now, I'll be treating this topic in two categories. One, I'll be looking at the personal and two, I'll be looking at the commercial uh, graphics design. For this video, I'll be focusing on apps for logos, for logo designs, flyers, posters, photo manipulations and cover ads. Now, for the first category, which is for personal use, I will recommend number one, the PixArt. It has a vast feature that a professional graphics design app should have, but lacks the freedom to use for monetization or creating content for clients. From the email I got from their team, after I inquired if I can use their app for commercial purposes, this is what I got. Obviously, the app is just intended for personal use, though I hate that policy, but what can I do? It's their, pro it's their property after all. Now, secondly, is the color app by PixArt. Now, it has the same rules with the PixArt, considering it's from the same um, developers, but really, the PixArt app is really good. It's really, really, really good. No doubt about it. It has a lot of features that is going to help you create professional logos and also carry out some, some amazing photo manipulations. I'm going to be dropping some videos in my channel also sharing with you guys some manipulations you can do with the PixArt and also designing some logos so that you can learn from my skills. And also there are a lot of these uh, uh, photo, photo manipulation skills out there on on YouTube, you can go ahead and search them up and you can find out that really you pix out is really good. I just wish they did not put that policy that hinders people, client or users from using it for client for monetization. Now, you are now living in the shores of Pioneer Cyberspace. Thanks for tuning in. Please like and comment. And if you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon. So we can go together, watch at the with every new update.